welcome to the first practical drawing lecture on swimland maps. In this lecture, we are going to discuss how to draw swimland with draw.i. To do that, you open your draw.io dashboard. You open a new blank document and then you go to the short shape menu over here and type swimland. After you type swimland, you see symbols appearing at the top left corner of this symbols view area. The swimland that we want is this one or the one the containing both lane and pool. So we click this one. You can also see the preview of other symbols as well here. So we click the required swim lane. On clicking the symbol, we can see there are three lanes and a pool. Suppose we want to change the name of the lane. To do that, we have to go to the name that we want to change and double click it. Suppose I change it to production and then I click somewhere on the diagram. So the name of the lane is changed. It is production. The lane represents the department or people who do different activities. So suppose I can change the name of this lane as well. Suppose it is the quality assurance. And suppose this is the management. So I change the name of this lane. I can also change the name of heading with activity work or work progress. Suppose I write work progress here and then we can drag the symbols from the general tab or more precisely from the flowchart. So here we can drag the symbol from the flowchart. Let us suppose that the process starts at the production and ends in the management level. So we can just drag and drop these symbols. There may be other symbols or other work functions such as the checking work functions of the quality assurance or different process functions of each of these departments so we can just drag and drop these symbols over here i can also copy and paste the symbols for that i choose the symbol click on ctrl c and ctrl v for copy and paste or i can simply drag the symbols from here and at the last i can combine all these symbols with the help of arrows suppose i combine this with this one and suppose the next step is this. This is another step. And suppose this is the final step. So we have formed a swim lane map describing different activities. I have already taught you that to connect any two different symbols, you have to hover around that symbol from which you want to connect. And when the green mark appears, you have to drag an arrow from that green mark and connect it to the green mark of the another symbol so here is how i connected this symbol with this one so this is how we draw the swimland map 